Hi everyone, this is Anchal. Welcome to my YouTube channel. This video is for people who wants to learn R programming from basic to advanced, or a people who wants to uh, learn from basic, okay, and for beginner. Actually, this video is for beginner. I have focused. I have totally focused on uh, who are uh, beginners to learn R programming, right? So, uh, if you are uh, new to this channel, please subscribe my channel. and uh, now i will uh, tell you what we will study in this video so in this video first of all i will tell you our introduction then why we should uh, use r for programming and uh, then uh, features of r and uh, advantage of r and disadvantage of r and then in lastly you will see the application of r where we use uh, where we use r programming and uh, what are the application of r okay now i will tell you what is r r is an open source object open source programming language that is widely used as a statistical software and data analysis tool r generally comes with a but with the command line interface r is available across widely used platform like windows linux and mac operating system also the r programming language is the latest cutting edge tool it means r is r is the open source programming language it means we can uh, freely use our uh, r programming there is no, no need to uh, give a money or uh, some uh, amount to use r we can just we can use r programming source code in our program by copying or uh, by learning from anywhere okay and what is the means of command line interface it means r uh, programming language is that type of programming language where we have to use some commands to run our program or so, Uh, when we want to create our program we have to use command line interface like uh, like we are using a uh, cmd like command line to uh, use some uh, commands okay so this is the uh, introduction and we have also some little introduction of uh, who develop r and where develop r okay so it was design r was designed by ross ihaka and robert gentleman at the university of auckland in new zealand and is and is currently developed by the r development core team r programming language is an implementation of the s programming language it it also combines with lexical scoping semantics inspired by scheme moreover the r project conceived in 1992 with an initial version released in 1995 and a stable beta version is 2000 okay so this is the introduction of r now we will see what is r used for it means where r we are using so r will be used in statistical interface in data analysis and machine learning algorithm it means where uh, where we want to uh, where we want to use uh, where we want to do data analysis there uh, r programming will be used okay so uh, uh, right now and uh, till now i have learned many uh, programming language one of them is r so why r programming language we should use so here we have some uh, here i have some points to tell you why we should use r language in our programming so this is the uh, here we have some points like uh, latest cutting edge tool means they, this technology is on uh, high on point uh, nowadays we are uh, seeing like uh, uh, everywhere uh, people uses data science to develop our uh, project and uh, to uh, analysis is the analysis the data information okay and uh, the another uh, feature is free installation and the vast community hottest trained and platform in independent and integrated with other language it means these are the uh, points uh, why we should use r in programming language right and uh, here we will see the description of the means of these words means uh, what is the means of free installation and vast community hot as trend and platform independent like that here i will tell you i have uh, prepared this uh, proper notes for you guys if you want to uh, learn uh, properly so this is the actual proper note where you can see the why we should use r programming okay so here you can see r programming is used as a, <coughs> a leading tool for machine learning statistics and data analysis object function and package can easily be created by r okay and uh, 
then another uh, point is why we should use R because R is an platform independent language this means it can be applied to all operating system okay like uh, we can use uh, this uh, R programming we can develop in R, R programming in any of Pro, uh, in a, any of operating language like uh, Mac operating system or Windows or Linux okay and many more <coughs> now we have another point it is an open source free language that means anyone can install it in any organization without purchasing a license here we no need to pay money for this for using uh, our programming for using programming our programming language this is an open source free language okay now next we have another point to use R. R programming uh, language is not only a static package but also allows us to integrate with the with other languages like C and C++. Thus, you can easily interact with many data sources and statical packages. The R programming language has a vast community of users and it's growing day by day. It means uh, there are many users who are using R programming, right? And it is growing day by day. Here another point is this. R, uh, R is currently one of the most requested programming language in the data science job market that, that makes it the hottest trend nowadays. It means nowadays you can see uh, like uh, data science is the, is the most trending topic in the market and uh, everybody uh, trying to learn data science and wants to become data science and in data science R programming language is used okay that's why and here we have R programming features so in R we have uh, features uh, in, in two types like statical features of R and programming features of R so what is the statical features of R first of all I will tell you so here the statical features of R is basic statics in this the most common basic static terms are the are the mean, mode, and medium. These are all known as major of central tendency. So, using uh, using the R language, we can measure central tendency very easily, right? And the another feature of R is in statical feature. Okay. So, what is the other uh, feature of uh, R programming language is? Static graphics. R is rich with facilities for creating and developing interesting static graphics. R contains functionality for many plot types including graphics, maps, map, mos uh, mosaic plots, by plots and the list goes on. And the next feature of R is probability distribution. Probability distribution play a vital role in statics and by using R we can easily handle various types of probability distribution such as binomial distribution, normal distribution, G squared, squared distribution and many more. And the last feature of R is data analysis. It is the important uh, feature of R. It provides a large coherent and integrated collection of tools for data, data analysis. So this, uh, this is the feature of R in point of uh, statical feature, okay? And now we will see programming feature of R. We will see here programming feature of R. So here I have programming feature of R that is we have R packages in R programming. One of the major feature of R is it has a wide availability of libraries. R has C RAN comprehensive R archive network which is a repository holding more than 10,000 packages ok now we have another uh, feature of R programming that is uh, distributed coding computing here distributed computing is a model in which components of a software system are shared among multiple computers to improve efficiency and performance two new packages ddr and multi d plier used for distributed programming in r were released in were released in november 2015 now what is r pro programming in r 
since r is much similar to other widely used language syntactically it is easier to code and learn in r program can be written in r in any of the widely used ide like r studio it means when we are using uh, when we want to develop uh, programs in r we should uh, we have to use uh, r studio and we have also some studio to use uh, uh, in r programming that is rattle and tin r etc after writing the program save the file with the with the extension dot r to run uh, the program use the r file name and dot r okay so this is a simple what we are doing in r to run the program in other video i will tell you how to create program in r and how we should use r studio to create our program in r now uh, you will see the definite the advantages of r programming so here r is the most comprehensive statistical analysis package as new technology and uh, and concept often appears first in r the second uh, advantage of r is as r programming language is open source thus you can run r anywhere in any and any time at any time now another uh, advantage of r is r programming language is suitable for gnu linux and windows operating system and here r programming is cross platform from which runs one which runs on any operating system it means we can run a uh, r programming in any of our operating system like windows linux uh, mac operating system or solar operating system or solaris and the another uh, advantage of r is in r everyone is welcome to provide new packages bug fixing and code and enhancements now we have r disadvantage r programming disadvantage so here we have some points of disadvantage of r so in the r programming language the standard of some package is less than uh, less than perfect although r commands give little pressure to memory management so r programming language may consume all avail all available available memory and another point is in r basically nobody to complain if somebody if something doesn't work means if uh, in r programming something uh, doesn't work we don't have anybody to complain it that this is this process is not working okay and the other point is r programming language is much slower than other programming language such as python and matlab matlab and application of r so here i have application of r where we can use r programming in real world okay so uh, we use r for data science it gives us a broad variety of li library libraries related to statics it also provides the in environment for statistical computing and design r is used by many quantitative analysis analyst as its programming tool thus it helps in data importing and cleaning r is the most prevalent language so many data analysis and uh, research programmers use it hence it is used as fundamental tool for finance now the last point is the last point application is that uh, uh, tech giant like google facebook bing twitter accenture bipro and many more using r nowadays so this is a uh, introduction part of r here here in this video you have seen uh, dis disadvantage advantage features of r and up, uh, and the introduction of r and what r is doing and why we should use r so thanks for watching this video and please share with your friends so that they can also learn r if they want and uh, please subscribe my channel so that you can also watch next video what i will upload in this uh, channel so same thanks for watching this video and uh, in next video i will tell you what uh, uh, keywords of r and data types of r so i will uh, upload that video in in upcoming one or two days thanks for watching this video